people have got a pretty amazing breaking story here tonight of the phenomenon of pareidolia, which is where something in the natural world psychologically evokes a symbolic image. In this case, two of NASA's X-ray telescopes um, through some very recent images dated January 9, 2014, this is published in space.com, have been compiled, these X-ray telescope images, to show what scientists are calling a hand of God. This is an enormous cloud of material which NASA's Nuclear Spectroscopic Telescope Array, or NUSTAR, glimpsed in high-energy X-rays shown in blue in the photo, that's that lower section. And NASA's Chandra X-ray Observatory had imaged the green and red parts previously using lower energy X-rays. So the hand and the fingertips, you see those orange fingertips, which I'm going to return to in a minute. You see them glowing people in kind of like a, an orange fuchsia color. The lower frequency X-ray and the, and the bluer part in the palm of the hand being the higher intensity on the X-ray spectrum. Now what this image represents, people, is a pulsar wind nebula. Now what a pulsar is, it's the remnants of the explosion of a supernova star. So literally, as this star is dying, we see this emerging hand of God. Now check out an edited image here and to the right inset I'm showing part of an image of the hand of God giving Adam life from the Sistine Chapel but perhaps even more compelling people is something that came to mind note ET's finger here glowing in orange as compared to the fingertips recorded by NASA's Chandra X-ray Telescope, glowing in orange. Now remember, people, in, in exactly one week from today, on January 16th, Earth will be passing through the orbital plane of Comet Ison's debris field. Now many people are saying Ison is dead and gone. There's nothing left to it. Well, that's not really true. Um, if you go back and look at some of my previous videos and some uh, other videos on people like BP Earthwatch, you're going to find that Ison, the debris field of Ison, did survive perihelion. Please drop your comments below. would like to hear your take on this. And thanks for watching. Stay tuned. I'm going to be covering this in the next few days.